Well, good morning, everyone. It really is wonderful to see you all here today for this announcement. Um, as mentioned, my name is Marilyn Dennis, and I have the privilege of serving as the president of the Alberta School Boards Association. And I am very pleased to be here this morning to bring remarks on behalf of our 61 locally elected public, Catholic, and Francophone school boards from across Alberta. Thank you to Premier Smith and to Minister Nicolades for prioritizing this investment into our education system. Thank you also to Minister Ellis, and also to the Calgary Board of Education Board Chair, Patricia Bolger, and CBE Trustees for hosting us in this beautiful facility. I also acknowledge trustees here from Calgary Catholic, from Rocky View Schools, and of course from the CBE. Your work is vital to the success of our education system, and thank you so much for the work that you do to support students. Today's announcement of increased operational funding will have a positive impact on all member school boards across this province, enabling them to hire more teachers and educational assistants, and the investment into new and relocated modular units will help accommodate historic enrollment growth, providing much needed learning spaces in our fastest growing communities. We appreciate that these funds will flow quickly and seamlessly to school divisions, allowing boards to make necessary preparations without delay. This will help to ensure that resources are in place when students return to classrooms this fall. As a trustee myself, I know that the focus of every trustee across this province remains on creating supportive and engaging learning environments where every student can thrive. We appreciate the government's recognition of the pressures that school boards are facing and these measures to help address them. ASBA values our strong relationship with Premier Smith and Minister Nicolades, and we look forward to our, their ongoing support for Alberta's locally elected school boards as the local voice for our communities. Thank you.